Hi, my name is Mike and I own Mike's Carburetor Parts. Uh, you can find uh, parts for most any carburetor at my, on my website www.mikescarburetor.com. Uh, I'm working on a Rochester 2G carburetor, two barrel, commonly known as the 2Jet. And I'm doing a series of videos uh, for uh, um, illustrating the rebuilding of this carburetor. And uh, I left off at uh, setting the float level and getting ready to put the uh, top on on the on the bowl. And uh, I uh, we did the float level, but I forgot to, to uh, do was the uh, float drop. So I'm going to do that right quick. And the float drop we're going to measure from the gasket to the bottom of the uh, well, holding it this way, the top of the uh, float, but we're going to do it upside down. So, kind of hard to see in the video from where the camera is, but uh, we're going to measure from the float all the way, excuse me, from the gasket all the way uh, down to the bottom of the float. And in this case, we need, uh, I think it was one and seven eighths. I'll check again. And we're too short. Let's see, was that right? Yeah, one and seven eighths. So, we're too short. So, um, I'm going to take this off. So I can do this with it still on, but I want you to see um, this tab here is all we bend for the float drop. And I'll bend it out a little bit because I need to drop a little farther. And uh, the float drop is uh, when the float drops down, that's what opens up the needle and lets the fuel in. So, um, it's important to have uh, close to the right float drop. They, they don't really have to be all exact, I don't think. But all right, so I'm going to measure from the gasket all the way to the bottom of the float, <clears throat> and that's looking pretty darn close right there. <clears throat> all right, so there you go for the float drop. All right, so we're going to position this needle so it's not going to hit. The, oh, by the way, the gasket, I, I thought it was wrong in the last video, which it was. I don't know what I did. I had two gaskets. I compared uh, the wrong one and the right one. Somehow I ended up putting the wrong one on. So And this part right here was open. So I just got the other gasket with the video off and got the right one on there. Anyway, so one that you've probably seen me put